You find us here at the Transformation Hub at MedLab Middle East 2020, and I'm joined here by Peter, who's going to talk to us about PCR1. Peter, what Hello. is PCR1? So PCR1 is a point of care uh, molecular uh, diagnostics device. Uh, point of care is wonderful because it can take you directly from the sample to the, to the answer. Uh, what's unique about PCR1 is that it's extremely fast. It uses the standard PCR reaction, which is most trusted, but uh, we have a twist to it. So we can do it in just a few minutes and complete the whole test in 15 minutes. The other thing that is really cool is that we run many PCR reactions at the same time so that we can give you an answer about 10 or 20 genetic targets in a single test. You've got one of the cartridges here, just show us around this. Yeah, so the, the cartridge allows you to, to insert the uh, sample into the cartridge, then you put it into the drawer of the machine yeah. um, and uh, you press run basically. Uh, and then in 15 minutes you get a result of up to here 32 separate PCR reactions and that allows us to diagnose 10 different genetic targets. So the first panel uh, targets MRSA. Yep. This is a very important and also dangerous uh, bug, pathogen, uh, that generates huge costs both on the human side and on the, on the financial side yep. uh, to the healthcare system. Uh, and this is a panel that uh, not only uh, identifies the presence of uh, MRSA, but also characterizes it completely. So it tells you whether it is resistant to antibiotics, makes sure that the resistant comes, uh, resistance comes from uh, Staphylococcus aureus, and it also picks up a variant that produces a very dangerous PVL toxin. So very, very specific the diagnosis there. Tell me what the runtime is uh, with one of these. So just 15 minutes uh, and uh, from sample to the answer. Uh, and obviously the system uses PCR, which is a very versatile reaction to um, detect the presence of genes. So we're already working on expanding the, 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 the panel portfolio yeah. to many different areas, both inpatient and outpatient uh, settings, so both for hospitals and for GPs, uh, including STIs, uh, gram-negative resistance, a very important topic now, uh, but also this could be used for airport security, for example, as we're very concerned now. Lots of applications, a really flexible product as well, certainly with uh, an exciting robot. Thank you so much for bringing it here to MedLab Middle East. Look forward to catching up with you next year, Peter, to yeah. find out where PCR1 has gone next. Thanks yeah. for now.